Do you think couples right now are having more sex because they are home together longer or less sex because they are home together longer? Why? I'm an introvert. So not dealing with people all day has left me with way more energy to head down to pound town. I have a healthcare adjacent role so I'm working from home but incredibly busy. My husband doesn't really have any sort of rigid schedule. We have a three-year-old. He's taken the kid out, with a packed lunch and snacks, to a nearby state park to play and roam and explore every single day this week since it still allows them to be adequately far enough from other people and allows me to get some work done in peace and quiet. Believe me when I tell you, that dude is definitely getting laid. Coronials. Going for round two in a few minutes. So, boredom helps. No time to respond. Having sex. You guys are getting sex. My wife doesn't get in the mood unless we've had a date. So no going out means no going in. Try and set up an at-home date. My girlfriend has her period 30 days a month. I am starting to get suspicious. That's not a period. That's a sentence. She invented social distancing over five years ago. I work in a STI testing lab. Significantly fewer samples over the last two weeks. Either people are having less sex with random people or they're having lots of sex and just not going to clinics. My wife works in the medical field and has terrible anxiety over the pandemic, leading to a much lower sex drive. She deserves strong oral support to relieve her stress. Coronavirus baby boom. Coronavirus baby boom. Coronavirus baby boom. Less. Sadly, we both frequently worked from home when the world was normal, and those days were some of the best loud freaky fun love making sessions ever. All the kids were in school and we had the house to ourselves. Now everyone is home. All the time. Ass Wednesday came and went with a silent quickie before the kids were all up. Rip Ass Wednesday. We have three kids at home age four, six and eight. Hate to burst your bubble but there is no sex going in in this house right now. Disney Plus just released onward. Get busy. Divorce rates in China skyrocketed due to Corona lockdown. Was a few articles about it. I don't know how it works out for couples, but I write smut for a living and people are definitely buying more erotica. Either people are home alone and looking to jerk it, or they're at home with their partners and just desperately, desperately want some alone time. Cries in long distance relationship. Well, I can tell ya one thing, my wife is having more sex. Is she on vacation? My wife said she loved having more sex on vacation. Worst postcard I ever got. Well find out in about 9 months. Slightly more. Since we are now full time working from home, I told my wife if she ever wants to take a break I'm 112% up for it. I coughed 3 times yesterday, so my ass is sleeping on the couch. I bet a lot of people who have been cheating with their co-workers are going through withdrawal right now. Whichever one it is, I hope people are at least stocking up on contraception. If in 3 to 4 years time I can't walk 10 paces without punting a toddler due to a baby boom in 9 months, I'm nuking the planet. I am masturbating a lot more, finally managed to make myself squirt today, did not know that was a thing I could do. As a married man of some 15 years, I can safely say it stayed around about the same, which is none, ever, never, that vagina has been in quarantine for three years. Work at a pharmacy, there has been an increase in Viagra prescriptions and Plan B sales. Birth control prescriptions are about the same as any other time. We are in our 50s and f like mink. Is, is that a lot? I know nothing about mink. Mink are like rabbits but hornier. Couples that are strongly attracted to each other and enjoy hot sex will likely do it more often. For those whose sex life diminished long ago, being around each other more probably won't make much difference, it might even decrease activity. I got three forms of birth control, called teenagers. Oh well. More. My roommates had sex three times this morning or maybe one time but over five hours. They're at it again but they put the TV on loud thinking it covers the sound this time. 
My partner and I have been quarantined together and haven't had sex in over a week. I think a mix of the stress and cabin fever is making us fight. We had a good sex streak before this so maybe it was time to let the jets cool. 24 hours later and still no sex. We did cuddle the f out of each other though. Hard. Well, considering my boyfriend and I just broke up, there will be a lot of self-love going on. None for me. I'm severely immunocompromised and my girlfriend works at an urgent care and is still having to go in. I can't see her until all this is over. Both. At first oh yeah we can finally have sex now then it's I'm bored. Let's have sex. Then it's God just leave me alone for a minute. Singles are masturbating like they are selling hot dogs. I can tell you who isn't having sex. It's the ones who have to look after their nightmare three-year-old because the nurseries are shut. Like us. Day 3. My love gun is already sore. Think of how the holster feels. I can't speak for everybody obviously but my fiancé and I are definitely testing the upper limits of her birth control. Less. People are way too stressed and anxious to be having sex rn. My boyfriend and I haven't had sex since like 2019 so now that we are both home all day together nothing has changed. My wife is a teacher and is home for at least 4 weeks. Sex has um, picked up a bit. We've been shut down since end of February. And I'm happy to report that it's more, so much more. But after 3 weeks together it's easy to get irritable with each other. So we all making a conscious effort to watch our tone and not take the stress of the situation out on each other. I can say we are having more sex. Sometimes you just get a feeling that you should check out the profile. Both. There's going to be a divorce boom and a baby boom. And those events aren't mutually exclusive. Divorce attorney. I'm expecting an uptick in business once this blows over. Bad marriages won't survive containment. I had perfectly planned crying PMS and now bleeding all over the f place so at my place. Not so much to be honest. There is uptick in the amount of people filing for divorce because they are working from home and realizing. Oh my god. I f hate my significant other. F it. I'm filing for a divorce. Source. MISA works a divorce law firm and they have seen a significant rise in fresh divorce cases. Condom sales have been going up in Germany or at least the region I am in so I do believe that we're gonna have some sort of mini baby boom in 9 months. My wife and I are stuck at home because we're both infected with something. One of our major symptoms are severe headaches. FYI orgasm helps for headache. Anything multiplied by zero is still gonna be zero. My wife. Had her period on our third date. Had her period on our wedding night. Had her period on our honeymoon. Had her period on our vacation to Bermuda. Had her period during her and my birthday. Started her period yesterday. I'm in FL where they just started closing more and more. Just moved from NYC. So, to answer your question, I'm trying. Well, I have been at home more than a week with my girlfriend still zero sex. I am just not in the mood. Be sure to talk with your partner and see if they are feeling the same. Or are upset but trying not to make a big deal about it because they are being considerate of your situation. This kind of stuff, if not discussed, is what makes people hate each other after period of unavoidably proximity. Our kids are also home. Six and four. So nope. The four-year-old is a certified professional cock blocker. If my husband and I are just spooning in bed, he will launch himself between us and declare he's the bacon for our sandwich. Not great for sexy times. But can you even get mad? My girlfriend and I are usually very active in this department. Ironically, we've been having less because we are both just so damn anxious, worried, and high-strung about things. It's hard to focus on making love when you're worried about the rest of the world collapsing and your family who has heart issues, diabetes. Probably both. Starts off with more sex. Before everything grates on them. Then there's no sex. Then they argue. Then they have makeup sex. Some virologists said that kissing is dangerous, but sex is fine, including oral, vaginal, and anal. Manual. 
Well given that my spouse and I finally made a decision to separate a week before the shit hit the fan, there is absolutely no sex happening, we are practicing awesome social distancing in our own house. God that sounds awful. Less the f Me and my girlfriend haven't done anything but play video games together. My husband's words Tuesday. Now that we are home we should have sex like we are trying to make a baby. Me. You mean no anal. Him. No. Like those couples who have sex when they want and sex on a schedule too. Would love to. But I'm ovulating. We're out of condoms. And we don't yet have his post vasectomy semen analysis results. Not taking any chances. Maybe next week. I'd be having sex a lot more if I was able to be with my girlfriend. But with this quarantine going on, it'll be at least another month before we're together again. Crying face. Hubby and I are definitely having more but check back after it's been a few weeks. I met this amazing girl right before everything started to shut down. We went on two dates and now I have to wait I don't know how long before we can see each other again. F corona. Me and my girlfriend aunt BC I live in her parents house with all of her siblings and we're all home 24 7 rn. I'm 6 weeks pregnant and my husband's afraid of kissing me BC he's afraid he might give me covid or something, he's the one going out making grocery runs, etc. So no, there's not more sex. There's no sex. And I'm starting to get morning sickness.